An Emmy award-winning act had little audience members moving and grooving in the Williston Library, but it was more than just entertainment. Bree Stahl has the story. Jack and Kitty have made their way across the country on a demanding tour schedule, but found the time to stop in Williston for a day. High school sweethearts, the duo got their start playing gigs in bars and clubs, but they say that eventually got old, so they decided to go back to school. Kitty became a teacher. Because when I was teaching, they were doing a fundraiser, and they volunteered us to do the music, and that, that's basically how it all started, and we realized, you know, we can actually have fun with music and apply, you know, what we learned in school and do music at the same time, and then it just kind of grew from there. Children's librarian Morgan Kaiser is working to bring in inspiring, engaging, and affordable events for children. As the library's rock-themed summer reading program comes to an end, it seems fitting to celebrate with a concert. So we chose Jack and Kitty because they've been here before um, and we really liked them. They're from Minnesota so they're close by and they're very, very good at what they do. Watching the duo bring little audience members to their feet, it's clear their show is also a dance party. Like we like to have a preschool mosh pit going on, so I mean, just to have fun. But behind Jack and Kitty's love for entertainment, these lifelong performers are hoping to inspire their fans with more than a love of music. Specifically for this tour, you know, encouraging kids to read and have fun at the library is super important. So I think just anything that makes kids want to keep reading some all summer long and keep learning, that's kind of our... Our biggest goal is just to get kids excited to go to the library. And while some kids dance, some clap, and some take a moment just to take it all in, there's no doubt they'll remember the library sometimes really does rock. For NBC North Dakota News, I'm Bree Stahl.